Hey there, I pulled some of my favorite templates that I found on Canva and I want to show you how to brand them very easily so they look like your content and not just these Canva templates. So what we'll do first here is I'm in the grid view. I'm going to go out of grid view, then I can see each one on their own. And I'm going to show you how to swap out the photos, change the fonts, and then how to export them so you can post them right away. So here we have some places for some photos. You're going to want to upload here. You can upload your files here. You can bring them in from your computer and anywhere that you have any of your stock photos or images of yourself saved, and then you're going to put them here. They're going to get dragged here, and then you can go and just slide in your photo. Here's an example. I just dragged that photo in. There it is. If I want to move it around, if I just double click on it, I can change what's showing. And if I pull from these little circles on the corner, I can zoom it in a little bit as well. Okay, next I want to change all of the colors. So I'm just going to click on a color that I want to change. And you can see it here. I come and click on this color dot right here. And I am using my brand kit to make these changes. So if you don't have your brand kit set up, make sure you check out my video about setting up your brand kit because it saves you so much time. All right, here, I wanna change this to another one of my neutral colors since this is kind of a neutral color here. I'm going to select a color and then I'm gonna say change all. So everything that's that color is gonna change. And now I can peek and decide what I wanna just go in and change uh, manually. So I want to change um, this circle behind here. You can see I'm having a hard time grabbing that. So what I want to do is go to position and go to layers. And then here I have that circle right here. Then it's a lot easier for me to choose. So I can come here and then I can change that to a more signature color. And I'm not going to change all because um, it'll change everything. I just changed that color as well. But now I can just manually go through and make some changes to the color. Click on this one. I can change that to my black. Background color. It's not very different, but just make it more on brand for me. Uh, these bars right here. I use more gray than I do the khaki, so I want to change that. Okay, so my colors are changed. So now I want to go and change the fonts. Each of these were just different templates that I pulled in from Canva, and so they're all going to have their own fonts that they're using, but I want to use the fonts in my brand kit. Let me show you how to do that quickly. So I can see that these are both grouped together, and I want to ungroup them just really quickly so I can just select this text. And then from the text drop down, you have all of these choices and recommended fonts. But if you scroll a little farther, you're going to see your brand fonts. And Prata is the one that I use for headliner. So I'm going to click Prata. And it looks like nothing else is that font. So I can't change all on that. And then this is my regular text. So I'm going to change that to my Gotham book that I use. And then I'm going to go through here, just change that to Prada. I might have to bump down the size a little bit. And then here, this um, Aileron, I am going to change to my Gotham Bold and then say change all. OK, so what I did here is I changed all of the fonts. And now I'm ready to swap in some more photos and put in my own colors. And then I'm ready to export it. So once you're done and you're ready to export all of these, you can go to share, then go to download, and you can decide which ones of these you want to export. You can do all five. If you don't want to do all five, just deselect that top box and then just choose the ones that are ready. And then you'll hit done and download. And now they're saved on your computer. And you can also open the Canva app on your phone, and this will be sitting there, and then you can export it there as well. All right. Have a great day and we'll see you next time.